Do you see why so many people are aversive to or scared of spirituality? Because they feel a lot would be taken away from them. They do not realize that they are being purified, not killed. It's, it's, it's different, is it not? Taking a bath is surely different from being administered poison. No? And when you take bath, surely you lose something, do you not? Assuming you do take a bath and not just hmm, use the towel to scratch your behind and rush out of the washroom. Take a bath, scrub yourself. You are losing a lot. When you lose stuff, it makes you shine. No, does it not? And that's why people say, now I am feeling fresh after taking a bath. What is this freshness that you experience? That which was not fresh has been scrubbed away. That's what spirituality does. What does fresh mean? Original. Huh? Just born now. Just originated right now. That is called fresh. In fact, the right meaning of the word original is this freshness. Fresh. Not coming from the stream of time. Originating just now. It is not coming from the past. It is not stale. That is called fresh. And how do you meet your own freshness? When you, when you went into the bath, did you apply a lotion that superimposed freshness on your body? Does it happen that way? No. You had freshness within you. But the freshness was badly hidden beneath layers of yourself. Let's say you have a lot of rubbish on your body. Huh? I ask you, who are you? You say, this is me. Now what have you touched? Your rubbish. So that's what. And your freshness you have not touched. What do we identify with? The rubbish. Hmm? You have a lot of rubbish on your face. I click a pic. What have I actually clicked? Your rubbish. But that rubbish you call as your face. So freshness doesn't come from outside. Freshness is when you scrub away, tear away that which never deserved to be on your face in the first place. Your real face is extremely beautiful. It's just that you have started believing, unfortunately, in a foolish and ugly face. Isn't it tragic? Firstly, the real thing is beautiful but hidden. Secondly, that which you are investing in and identifying with is so damn ugly. And yet, all your patronage is going towards it. If you have to favor one of these two, which one should you choose? Your beauty or your ugliness? And both are yours. One is in fact more yours than the other. As we said, sadly most people choose to be ugly rather than fresh or beautiful. Entire spirituality is just the encouragement 
to correct your choice. If you have to choose, why choose rubbish? Huh? Why not have some faith that even if you scrub something away, even if a layer is peeled off, there is something beautiful within. Have some faith. <laughs>